along with doing the cam cover powder coating this year also did a number of uh, brackets so i did the one for the um, brake reservoir changeover this is the adapter bracket just been taking the uh, high temperature tape off which you put on to stop certain bits getting powder coated <clears throat> i'd also done a couple of brackets uh, the alternator tensioner and also uh, the one that's holds the fuel regulator so i'm going to take the, uh, the last bit of tape off of this and start fitting it to the car So hopefully you've just seen in a few pictures how I managed to cut the original small shaft of the new master cylinder. Found a cut piece of tubing, one that I could weld straight onto the end of the uh, the stub. I chamfered the ends, um, obviously welded them, ground them down so I could get a tube over the over it completely. And I've actually plug welded the tube in a few places as well to extend it, and then the inner shaft protruded out the end so that obviously as it would hit against that one there it now hits against this one here and then I've uh, taken a file and filed down the, this little slot here same as the one on that side which is where a circlet fits so it all seems to go together okay uh, and then obviously taking it to a, a point as that one did so it sort of finds its way into the um, recess inside the pedal box on the brake pedal obviously <coughs> uh, initial fit I've just done looks pretty good seems to uh, just have a little bit of play on the pedal um, just this little touch of the back of there obviously there's a circle that goes on the back of that bit on the front of the pedal so I'm going to bow to a lot now um, yeah I'm pretty happy with that so far I've, got the, I've obviously uh, got the length the same but added in the 8mm spacer as I said earlier on so the distance from there to there is effective the same from there to there so hopefully all's good I've just quickly bolted the master cylinder back on. It locates nice and easy into the brake pedal. You've got to put a washer on the front of the brake pedal and also a circle clip to make sure it stays located properly. I've just put a couple of nuts on there quickly. The chance side we're coming off again a couple more times. I've managed to locate an old flared fitting down here for the rear one because it's obviously a bigger size than the front one so you can't get it mixed up. You can get an impression of how much space I've actually gained here because these were the pipes that used to go to the uh, that one there and there were the original front fittings for the original masking that had the servo on obviously I've gained a couple of inches which is obviously great and now I can repipe the uh, fuel supply through the correct way and then over to the the uh, pressure gauge as well so yeah coming on quite nicely 